Dozens of sick and dying sea lions are showing up on beaches north of Los Angeles. The culprit? Toxins. ABC 10 News anchor Aaron Dickens talked to a local expert about what's causing it and the likelihood that it's happening here in San Diego. A California sea lion weaving its head back and forth. It's being treated in Sausalito for what's called domoic acid poisoning. Officials say this summer there has been an uptick in cases in Santa Barbara and San Luis Obispo. This thing has been growing. We think in size, covering basically the range of San Luis Obispo, potentially all the way to San Diego. We Clarissa Anderson works for the Scripps Institution of Oceanography. She says the toxin comes from an algae bloom growing in the ocean. And that leads to seizures in our brain other kinds of overexcitation results, even like respiratory distress. We would experience the same thing if we were eating shellfish that were intoxicated with this toxin. And she says the animals are getting it from anchovies and the fish they eat. And there has been a lot of attention here at La Jolla Cove recently, and it's over the sea lions. You can see some of them hanging out behind me, sitting on the rocks. We have also seen several sea lion pups die recently. Anderson says it's unclear if that's from the toxin. The pups that we're hearing about in La Jolla Cove are possibly suffering from domoic acid poisoning, but we are going to have to wait to see. There will be recovery efforts and there will be testing and then we'll know more. And Anderson tells me she and her staff will continue to monitor this situation and they'll be in contact with the California Department of Health and marine mammal rescue organizations. In La Jolla, Aaron Dickens, ABC 10 News. SeaWorld says it's rescued two animals in the past two weeks, and they have symptoms of toxic poisoning. SeaWorld saw a larger impact by an algae bloom last year. San Diego has not been as impacted as that area north of Los Angeles.